One of these guys, the taller one, is presidential wannabe Mitt Romney, and he's quite literally in hiding. Give me a few minutes to explain why. In 2002, Mitt Romney, then president of the Salt Lake Organizing Committee, chose to allow a rodeo as part of the Winter Games cultural festivities. Romney allowed the rodeo after meeting with animal activists, including myself, reviewing rodeo video documentation, and acknowledging that rodeos are hard on animals, especially young calves. Romney said he would try to at least get calf roping removed from the rodeo. But when the rodeo mafia told him no, Romney simply accepted their dictate. Shark vowed not to let Romney forget what he did, and we followed through with our promise by having our Tiger video truck, which is equipped with four movie screens, follow the Olympic torch run around the country. That protest trip educated tens of thousands of people in some two dozen cities, from Indianapolis to the West Coast, about rodeo animal abuse. When Romney ran for governor in Massachusetts, the Tiger truck headed there too. The Tiger was waiting for Mitt when he came out of a debate in a Boston television station. Mitt Romney saw the truck and the brutal rodeo video that lit up the night and saw the message tying him to the cruelty. Then Mitt Romney demonstrated who and what he is. Mitt hid. Romney hid from the truck, but not from us because we weren't with the truck. We were ahead of it where we could see and video document his reaction and it was the behavior of a baby bunny hiding from a circling hawk. Of course, there was no real threat. The only thing that Mitt was afraid of and was hiding from was the truth. For some time, well after the other candidates had left, Mitt just hid and peeked and refused to leave the parking lot because to exit his vehicle had to drive right up to the parked Tiger truck. It was only after some big goons came down the drive to prep things for Romney that he left. When Romney left, he was hunkered down in the back of his vehicle like a spare tire. Shame on Mitt! Shame on Mitt! Shame on Mitt! Shame on Mitt! Now, Shark isn't a political organization. We are animal cruelty investigators and documenters. Shark is not pro or anti Democrat or Republican. We are not liberal or conservative. We are animal advocates, and we want people to know that Mitt Romney is not only a flip-flopper, Mitt Romney is also both cruel and a coward. Mitt Romney had a chance to do the right thing, and it was a real no-brainer, at least if Romney were leading the Olympics for the right reasons, and not just for his political future. With this video, we are keeping our promise to Mitt that we will never forget, nor will we allow him to forget his cruelty. And unlike Mitt, our word is our bond. This is Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness. Wasn't Fleming, Rodenet, and he'll be followed.